got another question here on the buffer solutions topic. So we're up to number four now. There it is there. So if you want to go that, pause the video and then play on when you're ready for the answers. So we'll make a start. You'll see I've already written up the Casanova salt expression. It should be your starting point for any buffer's um, calculation. So the H plus concentration of a buffer is equal to the Ka multiplied by the acid concentration divided by the salt concentration. So once you've waded through all the information about the sweet, it's magic tang and all that sort of stuff, basically all we want to find is the acid to salt concentration ratio. So we'll make that the subject of this equation. How do we do that? We take the Ka over to the other side and it goes underneath the H plus concentration. So we just need to sub in now the H plus concentration and the Ka. And the sort of twist in this question is they haven't given us those. They've actually given us the pH and they've given us the pKa of the lactic acid. So to calculate the H plus concentration from the pH, it's 10 to the minus pH. So 10 to the minus 3.55 divided by, so to turn pKa into Ka, it's 10 to the minus pKa. So this would be 10 to the minus 3.86. If you put those numbers in your calculator, you'll get an answer of 2, which means the ratio needs to be 2 to 1. So in other words, your acid needs to be double the concentration of the salt. And this second bullet point, comment on the validity of the prediction that the pH of the sweet would give the sweets their magic tang. Well, that's not really valid because there might be other chemicals in the sweet that are contributing to this tangy flavour that they've got. So it's not essentially linked to the pH of the sweet.